Garrett, now KSAT's been following the case of Lena Keel since she disappeared in 2021. There have been leads and developments in that time, but none so far have led to Lena. Our Patty Santos joins us live now here in the studio this evening. Patty, for years, an entire community has seemed hopeful and determined to find Lena. Yeah, that's right. And every time there is a new lead and a new search, there seems to be renewed hope. Here's a look at the timeline of this case. December 20th, 2021, 5 p.m. was the last time Lena Kill was seen playing in the playground of her apartment at Fredericksburg and Blue Mill Road. Around 7 p.m., San Antonio police were called and an Amber Alert was issued. Two days later, December 22nd, the FBI deployed their child abduction rapid response team and the Islamic Center of San Antonio announced a $75,000 reward for leads. On Christmas Eve, police released video of Lena. December 29th, the local search team joined authorities in a field search near her apartment. Three weeks later, January 5th, 2022, an FBI dive team flew in from Washington, D.C. to search a greenbelt near Babcock and Hebner. Six months into the search, Chief William McManus told KSAT there's no leads on her whereabouts. On the one-year mark of her disappearance, SAPD released new video of Lena from a home security camera. She was seen in the playground minutes before she vanished. In February 2023, an age progression sketch was released in hopes of generating new leads. Two months later, Lena's father volunteered to take a polygraph test at the FBI field office. And Lena's family, along with a local nonprofit, have teamed up with an independent investigator to follow up on any leads. Very much a mystery still tonight. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah Thanks, tonight. Patty. All right, thank you. Thank you for watching KSAT 12. If you are on YouTube, you can like and subscribe so you can stay up to date on all the latest news and weather here in San Antonio.